the link to MTG Burgeoning's Introduction to Plane Chase in the description below. Mirrored Depth's static ability makes each player flip a coin whenever they cast a spell. If they lose the flip, the spell is countered. Whenever you roll Chaos, target player reveals the top card of their library. If it's an on-land card, you may cast it without paying its mana cost. This plane wants the resolution of every spell to hinge on the outcome of one coin toss. However, for our spells, it won't just be one. If I were playing Plane Chase Commander and I wanted to add Mirrored Depths to the planar deck, then I would construct an EDH deck exploiting the coin-flipping static ability of this plane. Let's make this Commander deck a dedicated coin-flipping build by pairing Krark the Thumbless and Sakashima of a Thousand Faces as our partner generals. Sakashima can enter the battlefield as a copy of Krark in order to increase the coin-flipping shenanigans. Maybe your C, Fortune's Flame, is a more preferred option. Winning five flips from your C could be game-ending, particularly when we have Krark's thumb on the battlefield and under our control. Whenever we flip a coin, we flip two coins and ignore one result. This provides a great advantage over our opponents, as we will have two opportunities to successfully flip a coin, as opposed to just one. Since we are flipping so many coins, we must include Chance Encounter. Ten successful coin flips and we could win the game. If we are building a dedicated coin flipping deck, then we should include Ral Zarek, Tavern Scoundrel, Goblin Bomb, Fiery Gambit, Zinder Split, Eye of Wisdom, Okan, Eye of Chaos, and Stitch in Time. 